One careful owner. James Bond's original Aston Martin for sale. All gadgets, including bulletproof shield, revolving number plates, an oil slick sprayer and smoke screen, in good working condition. The machine guns have been disabled for safety reasons. Bond's most famous car, the DB5, is up for auction next October. But before it goes under the hammer for an expected three and a half million pounds, the 1964 Aston put in an appearance at Stoke Park Hall. The very same place where Sean Connery's Bond played his round of golf with villain Goldfinger. The car, which also featured in Thunderball, was bought by an American radio DJ for $12,000 in the 70s and has spent much of the last 30 years in a garage. Its reappearance was more than enough to get car and Bond enthusiasts stirred up. It's undoubtedly the most famous car in the world. Beyond that, it may not be a car at all. It's a cultural icon. I, in fact, myself, I cannot think of an object more widely known and desired around the world from the media age than this particular car. It's very special for me because I read a book called The Most Famous Car in the World, which is the history about all the James Bond Aston Martin cars, there were four of them, and this is the most original one that's left, so it's a piece of iconic history from films. Known by its original UK registration number, FMP7B, the vehicle is one of only two and the sole remaining of the original 007 DB5s. In the event, the car had to be towed away from Stoke Park because of a worn-out clutch. Or possibly a spot of sabotage by Goldfinger's hat-throwing sidekick odd job. Tanya Wood, Reuters.